on today's episode of Film Brothers, I'm going to talk about some stuff. We just got done shooting a bunch for our film henchmen, which is going to be a lot of fun. Um, just the the way we're shooting it and the cast and crew, but it's, it's it's been a lot of fun to experiment with. We had a lot of good people on set this last time. I think we can continue to build those relationships and things are going to turn out good for that film. Uh, stay tuned for that one. So the other thing I wanted to talk to you about, um, and I, we just couldn't do it during uh, filming, uh, was Kevin Conroy died. Kevin Conroy is someone that meant like a lot to us. A couple years ago, we went and saw him at Comic-Con. And it was just kind of happenstance. We kind of thought it would be super crowded, but it, I mean, it was crowded. There was a lot of people there to see him. It wasn't just him. Uh, There's some of the other cast members from the Batman animated series. It was just kind of a really neat experience to hear him speak and talk about the show and share stories about Mark Hamill. And I know he meant a lot to us, like, especially in our childhood and, and, and a lot of people our age, a lot of people that have watched Batman over the years, um, the animated series, you know, they're, they're going to feel that sting pretty deep. And so it's, uh, he, he's one I'm going to miss. He's one I'm going to miss. I, I'm, I'm, I was always excited for when Kevin Conroy was going to come back for like a video game or to voice Batman. Like it, it always excited me when that happened. My first introduction to him was actually in Mask of the Phantasm. I didn't have TV growing up. My parents, we just, we just didn't have it. And we're from an area where, you know, having TV, unless you have cable, and, and I didn't have that back in the <clears throat> 90s, whatever. So I had movies um, and I had the movie, The Mask of the Phantasm, which still to this day, remains one of my more favorite Batman films. Probably my most favorite animated Batman film of all time. The Killing Joke is is pretty far up there for me. Um, and an aesthetic to Gotham that was interesting and Conroy was there voicing Batman and giving tons of depth to Bruce Wayne. One of the better love backstories I think Batman's ever had, honestly. It's just, it's a really great film. If, if, but if, if you haven't had the chance to see it, definitely take the opportunity, uh, rent it, buy it, whatever. It's, it's, it's worth your time. And that was my introduction, Kevin Conroy, as both Bruce Wayne and Batman. His voice has stuck in my head for Batman. Whenever I read a Batman comic, his voice sticks with me. So Fan Fusion, Phoenix Fan Fusion, is in July, January? No, July, I think, yeah. So I don't know, maybe we should, Think about doing that. It kind of sounds like it could be fun. It's kind of a, a fun tradition that we got away from mostly because of COVID. But all right, man. I just wanted to talk about Kevin Conroy. I'll uh, catch you on the next one.